have been teased with near four-cylinder models from MV Augusta before, but after today's announcement, the follow-up story that MV Augusta will launch its new four-cylinder platform in 2018 seems actually plausible. Something we were expecting at this year's ICMA show, MV Augusta CEO Giovanni Castigliani has already shared that we can expect to see a 1,200cc four-cylinder brew tail in the near future. We say this because its naked street bikes are MV Augusta's best sellers, so we expect the new brew tail to be given the nod over a new F4 superbike, in terms of priority, primarily because of financial reasons. This will be bad news for racing fans, as there had been hopes for a new superbike platform, as the MV Augusta Reparto Course World Superbike team has reached the limits of development for the current F4 package, which was a big reason Leon Kamir left MV Augusta for Honda. It looks like for World SBK the MV Augusta squad will be on the current F4 through the 2018 season, and likely on it well into 2019. Meanwhile for street bike riders, we can expect to see a new MV Augusta Brutale 1200 sometime later this year. Whether it will be a new model release at ICMA, or bikes in dealerships late summer, remains to be seen. We can also expect the 1200cc four-cylinder platform to be the basis of future street models, with a bigger version of the Turismo Veloce being our top pick. With MV Augusta's ownership structure now solidified, and its debt restructured, the Italian brand finally seems ready for business. Stay tuned.